Part of Instagram's appeal is that it makes it quick and easy to make your photos pop and then share them with your friends. You just take a photo, slap on a filter to give it a little style, and share it. But what if you want to dig a little deeper than Instagram's stock presets? I'm Donald Bell, and I'm here to show you the advanced image controls available in Instagram 6.0. So let's open up the app, select a photo to use, and then hit Next. Now here's the screen where all the magic happens. On the bottom, you'll see the usual tray of filters that you can tap through and find one that brings a little extra life to your photo. They're great, but what if you want something a little more subtle? With Instagram 6, you can tap and hold on that filter and bring up a slider bar that you can use to blend in just the right amount of the filter with your original photo. The same hidden control lets you toggle the filter's frame on and off, something you used to be able to do from the main screen. When you're happy with it, tap the check mark. But that's not all. Above the filters, you'll see two gray icons. The middle one is called Lux, and it's Instagram's proprietary blend for adjusting exposure and sharpness. Just like filters, Instagram now gives you a slider control to dial in just the right amount. You can bring it down to a soft haze or crank it up for extra grit. But when you really want to get fiddly, tap the wrench icon. Here you can rotate the image, adjust brightness, contrast, warmth, saturation, highlights, shadows, vignette. You can apply a tilt shift blur or you can sharpen things up. It's like a little mini Photoshop hidden underneath one of the simplest photo apps on the planet. As someone who's found myself using other apps to edit my photos before bringing them into Instagram, these new controls have made things much easier. I can now do everything I need right within the app. So now you know how to access the advanced editing tools in Instagram. For more tips like this, visit cnet.com slash how to.